In Australia, 60% of small businesses will fail within the first three years, and a staggering 50% of those who fail were actually profitable. Time and time again, top reasons they fail are due to a lack of funding and cash flow mismanagement. With so many different assets you can finance and all of the respective loan products, you need an expert to help you navigate this tricky landscape. And that's what I'm here to do today. Hi everyone, Luke Z from SF Capital here. Welcome to our latest video series on asset finance. Today, I'm gonna to tell you the secrets on how to use asset finance to achieve faster business growth and more cash flow. Growing up, a lot of us are taught to save, 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 and that borrowing money is not good. But in business, cash is king. So how you spend your precious cash is critical to your success especially when you're looking to purchase an asset with the goal of taking on more work, bigger jobs, or simply operating more efficiently. If you only use cash to purchase assets, it would take you a long time, or you may never get there at all. This is where asset finance comes in. But let's start with the basics first. What assets can you finance and what loan products are available? The assets you can finance can be grouped into three categories, primary, secondary, and tertiary. Examples of primary assets are cars, trucks, earth moving equipment, trailers, and agricultural machinery. Secondary asset examples are medical, dental equipment, print and packaging equipment, food manufacturing, plant services, and so on. And finally, tertiary asset examples are fit outs, IT equipment, fitness equipment, scaffolding, point of sale systems, software, and etc. As you can probably tell, Primary assets have more resale appeal than secondary assets. Secondary assets have more resale appeal than tertiary, whilst tertiary assets virtually have little to none. This is the general differentiator between them, and various asset finance lenders have different risk appetites regarding which ones they will finance. The list is so exhaustive, you could quite confidently say, if it has a serial number and a business purpose, there is an asset finance lender out there for it. In terms of the products available, there are four. Number one, shadow mortgage. Number two, commercial hire purchase. Number three, finance lease. And number four, operating lease. To decide between them, you should discuss the tax and cash flow benefits with your accountant. Because depending on your situation, these can be much more material than the interest cost. Hence, it should be at the top of your considerations. In our next video, we will explain the requirements to get these approved because not all products and lenders are created equal. So there you have it. The three categories of assets you can finance and the four products available. Remember, if it has a serial number and a business purpose, then there is a lender out there who will finance it. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know in the comments below. Subscribe for the next one and don't forget to follow SF Capital on Facebook, LinkedIn, and Instagram. I look forward to seeing you in the next one.